With PSSE, Siemens PTI offers a comprehensive high-end analysis software solution for all your transmission system planning needs. The PSSE base package can also be further enhanced to include a rich ecosystem of optional add-on modules. The PSS GUI holds all the tools and functions needed to gain insight into your system. In this tutorial, we'll show you a few key areas within the interface. The GUI is broken down into five main parts. At the top, you'll find the menu and toolbars. You'll use these options to open files and run activities. On the left are the tree views within the Study Explorer. These are used for navigation. The center gray area is the main area where you'll see spreadsheets, diagrams, single line diagrams, and plots. The output bar is toward the bottom of the screen. Here you'll see progress messages, alerts or warnings, and report outputs. At the very bottom you'll find the command line input. This is used to submit commands directly to the PSSE engine. This can be done either through the PSSE or Python response format. In Python format, you can submit any properly formatted Python commands PSSE will pass on to the Python interpreter. Next, let's explore some new features of PSSE 34.2. In the latest version, you can use maps within your diagram. When you load a diagram, PSSE also brings in several map tiles to go behind the diagram. You can adjust the latitude and longitude for the diagram by clicking Diagram, Properties. Once you've entered the correct information, the map populates behind your diagram. To use maps, you need to submit an API key which can be obtained from a map service provider. To enter the key, click Edit, Preferences. Select the Diagram tab and then select Global Settings. Here you can enable the background maps and choose the service you'd like to use. You can also select a map type. Enter your API key and click OK. Another new feature is the multi-screen interface. To use this feature, right-click on the tab for the diagram and select Put in New Window. A new frame is drawn and the diagram moves to that window, but you can move it to wherever you'd like. If you need to move it back to the main window, right-click the tab again and select Put in Main Window. The animation of flows has been improved in the latest version of PSSE. Now when you animate the flows, arrows move across the entire line. The arrows can be scaled to see the difference between flows as needed. To toggle scaling, go to Diagram, Properties, and select Scale Flow Arrows. These new additions to Siemens PSSE 34.2 will help take your simulation and analysis to the next level bringing efficiencies to your system like never before. Siemens. Ingenuity for life.